Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to the Rideshare Hub. My name is Dylan. Thank you so much for coming by. So in today's video, we're talking about Play Octopus. Play Octopus is a tablet company that sends Uber and Lyft drivers a completely free tablet to put on the back of your headrest and they pay drivers as much as $100 per month. Pretty awesome, right? Well, today's video, I'm gonna be telling you seven reasons why you should get Play Octopus. And there are some cons to Play Octopus as well, which I will be addressing at the end of the video. In my experience, there's more good than bad, but let's give you the full picture. So before I get into the video, if you are interested in signing up for Play Octopus, you can go ahead and use my referral code down below and link when you do sign up. And I do just wanna make a quick disclaimer. They are focusing on signing up regularly active drivers who complete at least 25 rides per week. If you don't hit that every single week, that's okay, but they are looking for drivers who are pretty regularly active, just so you guys know. So if you just signed up for Uber or for Lyft, get a few active weeks going and then sign up with my LinkedIn code. So the very first reason to sign up for Play Octopus is passive income. You earn money simply by plugging in a tablet into your car, plugging it in, setting it up, and honestly, for the most part, and I've used Play Octopus myself, most of the time, you're just driving around and you kind of forget that the thing's even back there. It's not like you're telling your pastors to play the games all the time. They see the games, it does the work for you. It even has a little screen on there that says play me and it's, it's like pretty much a black screen and then it lights up and says play me. It's very non-pushy, very chill, but it does. it is super fun. I've played the games myself and passengers are really incentivized to play the games because they can win cash prizes. So you can earn money, and how does the driver earn money? That's a great question. Well, in between uh, every couple of games, there is an ad that plays for, I don't know, some random company that Play Octopus is partnered with, and the driver actually takes some of that revenue. So that's how Play Octopus is able to pay their drivers. And you, as a driver, do get paid more for the more you drive and the more your passengers actually play the games. So the second reason to sign up for Play Octopus is because of passenger ratings. So Play Octopus actually has found in their studies that drivers ratings increase 30% simply by having a tablet in the backseat of your car. And I can actually attest to this because one time I was driving for Lyft late at night doing a bar pickup and I was picking up a intoxicated couple. Something that I always tell my tell drivers to do in these videos is keep your doors locked at pickup. And I always ask them what their name is. I never just let somebody get in my car, especially super late at night. So I rolled down my window, had my door locked, and I said, hi, what, hi, are you here for a lift? Hi, what's your name? And she was like, nope, I'm a girl. You tell me what your name is, and I go, well, I don't know if I have the right passenger. I need you to tell me your name. She goes, no, no, that's not how it works. I go, look, that's the my only security. You can just look at my license plate if you want to make sure that it's the right car. And um, her boyfriend was like, no, 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 come on. Let's just get in. Let's get it. So anyways, they ended up getting my car and they were mad. I could tell they're probably going to rate me a one star and maybe even report me. However, two to three minutes in the ride, I noticed they started playing Play Octopus and they started laughing. They honestly probably forgot about the whole thing at the beginning. I started, because I didn't even barely talk to them at the beginning because I knew it was just awkward. They're already mad at me. So, you know, when you're intoxicated, you get mad pretty quickly. Anyways, I started going, oh, you play playing that game over there? Oh, you should win. You know, you could win 25 bucks if you get if you get the top score, whatever. And they were like, oh, blah, blah, blah. They started talking to me. They, I could tell they were dating. And I go, oh, how long have you guys been dating or something? I don't know. I just asked them a question. And then they started talking. And then they started asking me about my dating life. And they were giving me whole advice. At the end of the day, at the end of the trip, they tipped me $5 <laughs> and left me a five-star review. So Play Octopus alone turned that one-star ride into a five-star ride with a $5 tip. Which leads me into my next point, is that Play Octopus definitely leads to better tips. And I'm gonna teach you guys a secret right now, okay? If you have Play Octopus, your passengers will ask you about it. Trust me, they will definitely ask you about it, especially um, like the fun passengers. You guys know the fun ones. When your passengers ask you about, oh, what is this? 
you don't need to go on a big spiel with oh yeah you know play octopus is this company that pays me to have this up there you honestly like the and i'm sure every driver does it differently but the way i do it is i kind of don't tell them the full story i just say i don't lie to them right i just say oh yeah you know i i just put up i just put the tablet in here to make a better experience for you guys because i love my job and I want you guys to have the best experience. It's not like I'm saying, oh yeah, I went out and bought a tablet, but like you can kind of phrase it in a way for them to know, oh, this driver is going way out of his way. And honestly, just for the mere fact that you went out and downloaded Play Octopus and got this does mean that you care more about providing a better experience anyway, but you will definitely get more tips. The fourth reason, and honestly, the money thing is great. The money and ratings is all great, but the fourth reason is that it's fun. Guys, trust me, this makes rideshare driving so much different. <laughs> you know the difference between like, oh, I gotta get out and drive for Uber and for Lyft, I gotta do rush hour, I gotta take people sit in traffic. If you even sitting in traffic and you got people in your backseat playing Play Octopus, you're having a fun ride. It literally is like an icebreaker. And if you guys have been driving Uber and Lyft for a while, you know that you kind of need an icebreaker with every single ride. And that means how do you get from you're the Uber driver or Lyft driver to, oh, let's kind of be more friendly with my passengers and have a good conversation. Because trust me, having a go good conversation helps your day go by quickly. So the fifth one is the community. And I'm big on this one, but Play Octopus has a super awesome Facebook group. They send out emails with shout outs, driver shout outs. They do cool interviews with drivers. And if this was before the illness, they actually threw parties for drivers and I actually went to one. It was an awesome one. They were giving us free food. I met a bunch of other drivers. I met people from the Plactibus team. They were traveling around the country, guys, and meeting drivers. What other company does that? I've never heard of another company that flies around the country. They basically went on tour. Nikki, I know. <laughs> Um, I was like, dang, that's so awesome. So the sixth reason why Play Octopus is awesome and you should sign up for it is because of their customer support. Guys, Play Octopus, if you have, ever have any issues or if you ever, you know, want to talk to them, they have phone support and email support seven days per week. Okay, and the last reason to sign up for Play Octopus is because they have an awesome team. And... I wanted to point this out because they are technically still a startup company, I believe, or maybe they're kind of growing out of that, but they they started out as a startup and they started out just trying to create, uh, you know, what's where's the best way to advertise to people? And they figured, well, why not advertise to rideshare passengers? They're a great team. They're super, they're small, but they're they're hardworking. I can see them on social media, put it in their work, put it in their hours, and they're honestly super nice. I've never had like a bad conversation with any of the anyone on their team. Every time I talk to them, they love talking to drivers too. Like, could you imagine if the Uber CEO was like talking to drivers all the time? Like, hey, you know, let's hear your feedback. They what do they do? They send out those weekly little like surveys that they're just probably using to send that to investors. Like they don't really care, uh, but Play Octopus really does care. Now I did want to talk about a couple of the downsides of Play Octopus. Right now they're not in every single market in the United States, which is important to know because if you're driving in a certain area that Play Octopus doesn't exist, you currently are unable to earn on their platform. Now they are trying to expand and again, this is totally normal, but this was a question that I've received a lot, so I did want to address it, is why aren't they everywhere? Well, I don't work for them, so I don't know the exact answer, but I assume that they need people who work regularly, you know, every single week actively, and for them to market their app in, you know, San Francisco or something where there's thousands and thousands of drivers driving you know, 10, 10, 20, 30 rides every single day versus some random town in Arkansas. Like they're probably, it's probably not worth it for them to run Facebook ads in that random town in Arkansas because there's gonna only, they can probably only hire like 10 people in that random town. So like 
I get it, but at the same time, like, it just would be nice if they could be everywhere, but hopefully that will be soon. Just know that when you select the list, you do have to be within like 50 miles or so of that city. A couple other things I did want to touch on, and these are two other big questions that I have been receiving as well. And the first one is, is it safe to use right now because of the illness going on? And a really cool feature that they just launched is a contactless trivia. So riders can actually still play Play Octopus and still try to win those cash prizes through scanning a QR code that is on the tablet. So if a passenger doesn't want to, you know, touch the tablet for obvious reasons, then they can do that as well. Now, I did also want to follow up with that by telling you guys that I have a lot of friends who I've actually seen on their Snapchat and Instagram stories of them playing Play Octopus in other rideshare cars like normal and to be honest, I think the vast majority of people don't really care. Like, people are washing their hands frequently, and as you as a driver, all it takes is for you, you know, if you're driving rideshare, should be wiping down and disinfecting frequently touched areas anyway. You already do have about 10 areas you need to wipe down. Um, you know, the door handles, the seat belt, where you lean your arm, and the outside of your door handles. Wiping down a tablet really quick, it might honestly maybe add another three seconds. <laughs> so if you're hesitant because of that, just know there is a contactless feature, and honestly, the tablet is pretty small. You could probably get away with one or two quick wipes. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Again, if you do wanna sign up, check out the links down below. If you also want to sign up for Uber and for Lyft, there will be links down below for that as well, as well as for Yada Savings. I really do personally love Yada Savings. I love Play Octopus. Thank you, Play Octopus. Thank you to all of you for watching today's video. Big shout out to Play Octopus and their whole team for just being awesome. And let's all give the video a big thumbs up for Play Octopus. And thank you all for watching today's video, and I will talk to you all soon. Have a great day, guys. Bye.